Come on, Joker. We have to get out of here. No, I won't abandon the Normandy. I can still save her. The Normandy's lost. Going down with the ship won't change that. Yeah, okay. Help me out. Commander Shepard has been recovered. The Lazarus Project will proceed as planned. Showing an awareness of his surroundings. Oh my God, Miranda, I think he's waking up. Damn it, Wilson, he's not ready yet. Give him the sedative. Shepard, don't try to move. Just lie still. Try to stay calm. Heart rate's still climbing. Brain activity is off the charts. The stats pushing into the red zone. It's not working. Another dog. Now. Heart rate dropping. Stats falling back into normal range. That was too close. We almost lost him. I told you your estimates were off. Run the numbers again.
This pistol doesn't have a thermal clip. It's a med bay. We'll get you a clip from. Damn it! Those canisters by the door are going. Keep your head down, Shepard. Shield yourself from the blast. Someone's hacking security, trying to kill you. Look for a thermal clip for your pistol. Looks like they set up a barricade to try holding the mechs off.
do in surprise. Probably no more than I do. Right, sorry about that. I'm Jacob Taylor. I've been stationed here for hostiles detected. Damn it! Things must be worse than I thought if Miranda's got you running around. I'll fill you in, but we better get you to the shuttle first. What's with the mechs? Security. Usually they fight for us. Somebody must have hacked them. That should be impossible. Unless you've got access. We've got to get you out of here, Shepard. It's your station, Jacob. I'll follow you. First step, let's finish off these metal bastards. We're low on thermal clips, but I'm a biotic. Just give the order when you want me to hit them with the good stuff. Ready to get the hell off this station? What's the quickest way to those shuttles? Depends where the mechs are thickest. It's probably best if check, you... Check, check. Anyone on this frequency? Anybody still alive out there? Hello? Wilson, this is Jacob. I'm here with Commander Shepard. Just took out a wave of mechs over in D-Wing. Shepard's alive? How the hell... Never mind. You need to get him out of there. Get to the service tunnels and head for the network control room. Roger that, Wilson. Stay on this frequency. Let's get out of here. You bet. We can get into the service tunnels through this door. We've been spotted. the first time I regained consciousness. Yeah, that was me. <laughs> How about we talk about this after we fix my leg? Should be some Metagel in the first aid station on the wall. Hopefully there's enough to get him up and moving again. Grab the Metagel from the first aid station on the wall. Wilson's hurt bad. He needs help.
Thanks, Shepard. <clears throat> Never thought you'd save my life. Guess that makes us even now. <laughs> I thought maybe I could shut down the security mechs, but whoever did this fried the whole system. Completely irreversible. We didn't ask what you were doing. Why do you even have security mech clearance? You were in the bio wing. Weren't you listening? I came here to try and fix this. Besides, I was shot! How do you explain that? I don't care who set up who. Those mechs are shooting at all of us. We'll sort it out later. We need to find Miranda first. We can't just leave her behind. Forget about Miranda. She was over in D-Wing. The mechs were all over that sector. There's no way she survived. A bunch of mechs won't drop Miranda. She's alive. Then where is she? Why haven't we heard from her? There are only two possible explanations. She's either dead, or she's a traitor. Then why did you wake me up and warn me about the attack? Okay, maybe she's not a traitor. But that doesn't change the facts. We're here, she's not. We need to save ourselves. The shuttle bay is only a few... We can overload the canisters to clear a path to the shuttles. Requesting assistance. I just don't know when to quit! Rerouting all our forces have the range. Careful, critical system. Requesting assistance. The fastest way to the shuttles is through those canisters. Get out of here. Okay, we took him down. But this is getting tense. Shepard, if I tell you who we work for, will you trust me? This really isn't the time, Jacob. We won't make it if he's expecting a shot in the back. If you want to piss off the boss, it's your ass, Jacob. The Lazarus Project. The program that rebuilt you. It's funded and controlled by Cerberus. I wiped out my share of Cerberus projects when I was a Spectre. Back then, they were trying to kill me. Why the change of heart? Those answers are way above my pay grade. But basically, things change. The Alliance declared you dead. They gave up. Cerberus spent a fortune to bring you back. Look, I'd be suspicious too. But right now, we have to work together. I thought you deserved to know what's what. Once we're off the station, I'll take you to the elusive man. He'll explain everything. I promise. I don't care what they did or what you say. I'm not working with terrorists. You can tell it to the boss. But after we've saved our butts, we're almost at the shuttle.
recovered, but the damage is far worse than we initially feared. In addition to the expected burns and internal injuries from the explosion, subject has suffered significant cellular breakdown due to long-term exposure to vacuum and sub-zero temperatures. Despite the extent of the physical trauma, Wilson assures me subject is damageable. The Lazarus Project will proceed as planned. Through here. We're almost at the... Miranda, but you are... Dead? What the hell are you doing? My job. Wilson betrayed us all. Even if you're sure, did he deserve that welcome? He sabotaged the security systems, killed my staff, and he would have killed us. You sure about that, Miranda? We've known Wilson for years. What if you're wrong? I'm never wrong. I thought you'd have learnt that by now, Jacob. You should have taken him alive. See what he knew. Too risky. I've put too much time and effort bringing you back to life to let you get killed now. You really think Wilson's capable of that? Not anymore. If you say so, what's our next step? We get on the shuttle and go. My boss wants to speak to you. You mean the elusive man? I know you work for Cerberus. Ah, Jacob. I should have known your conscience would get the better of you. Lying to the commander isn't the way to get him to join our cause. Well, since we're getting everything out in the open, is there anything else you want to ask before we go, Commander? I've had enough of this station to last a lifetime. Or two, in your case. Come on. Before you meet with the elusive man, we need to ask a few questions to evaluate your condition. What, we have to do this now? We should have done weeks of testing to confirm the success of Project Lazarus. A few questions during the shuttle ride will have to suffice. Okay. Records show you grew up on Earth. Tough environment, no parents. You enlisted and you survived a Thresher Maw attack that wiped out the rest of your team. Do you remember that? I lost a lot of friends that day. Going through something like that changes you. It can break you, if you let it. I read the report. Fifty Marines died on a coups. You were the only one who lived. Satisfied, Miranda? Almost. Let's try something more recent. Vermeer, where you destroyed Saren's cloning facility, you had to leave one of your squad behind to die in the blast. Lieutenant Caden Alenko was killed in action. It was your call. Why did you leave him behind? I left a friend to die that day, and I didn't do it casually. But I had to save as many people as I could. Caden gave his life for the rest of the team. Without him, I couldn't have stopped Saren. He died a hero. I understand, Commander. And I wasn't judging your decision. Everybody at Cerberus knows that cloning facility had to be destroyed. There are other tests we really should run. Come on, Miranda. Enough with the quizzes. The memories are there, and I can vouch for Shepard's combat skills personally. I suppose you're right. We'll have to hope the elusive man accepts our little field test as evidence enough. <laughs>